Understanding the phrase, crime lord. Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving into a fascinating English phrase, crime lord. This term pops up in news stories, TV shows, and movies, but what does it really mean? Whether you're learning English for fun, for work, or just to watch your favorite shows without subtitles, grasping these phrases can give you a richer understanding of the language. So, let's break it down together. The phrase, crime lord, is made up of two words, crime, which refers to any illegal activity that is punishable by law, and lord, which traditionally means someone with power or authority, like a ruler or a nobleman. When combined, these words describe a person who controls a large organization that is involved in illegal activities. To understand the term, crime lord, it helps to see it in context. Picture a character in a movie who is always surrounded by bodyguards, wears expensive suits, and seems to have a lot of power over people in the underworld. This person might be involved in various illegal activities, from smuggling to running illegal gambling rings. They are not just a thief or a small-time crook. They are a big boss in the world of crime, hence the term, Lord. A crime lord usually has a network of people working for them. This can include lawyers who know how to bend the law, accountants who can launder money, and enforcers who make sure people pay their debts. The crime lord is at the top of this criminal hierarchy and makes the major decisions. They often try to avoid being directly linked to any criminal activity to evade the police and continue their illegal operations. Why is it important to know phrases like, crime lord? Well, English is full of idiomatic expressions and phrases that you won't find in a textbook. Learning them can help you understand the nuance and context of conversations and media. It also helps you communicate more effectively by understanding the connotations and the seriousness of different roles and activities within society. And that's a wrap on, Crime Lord. Understanding such phrases can really open up the depth and breadth of English and give you insights into both language and culture. I hope this explanation helps you in your journey to become more fluent in English. Keep learning, and I'll see you in the next video.